We now have a song by the audience, Goodness of God. I must say now that I need someone to help raise the song, I'm not that much of a singer. So I'm looking for volunteer to start. for this ceremony and former Deputy Principal of GMSSF, Mrs. Gillian Archibald, featured speaker, Mr. Fidel Flaherty, Deputy Chairperson of the School Board, Mrs. Gloria Ezra Robinson and other members, immediate past chairperson, Mr. Joyce Ward. Mr. Chad Kelly and other members of the PTA Executive, the staff of our beloved school, parents, other family members, and well wishes of the graduates, graduating class of 2022, 
Pastor Bernard Boland and Mrs. Boland, distinguished guests, ladies and gentlemen, and let me not forget the media team that we have here. Wallace Atnell, um, photographer, Mr. Willard. Good afternoon. I'm not hearing you. Good. The 2022 report. The 2022 school year commenced on Monday, the 9th of September, and will culminate on Friday, the 8th of July. It began with a population of over 148 pupils, comprising of 67 boys and 81 girls, and ended with 67 boys and 80 girls. Staffing. This comprised of Principal Mr. Anthony Wilcher, trained teachers Mr. Della Richardson, Deputy Principal and Grade 2 teacher, Mrs. Rona Thompson, Grade 3, Mrs. Tracy Atherton, Grade 4, Mrs. Stuart Rollins, Grade 6. Untrained graduate teacher, Ms. Curticia Smitten. Untrained teachers, Ms. Jacqueline Leibert, Ms. Akila Richards, and Ms. Shitara Williams. Teacher assistant, Mrs. Lisa Jew. Secretariat, Mrs. Alexia Johnson, and Mr. Alan Brown. Auxiliary, Ms. Karen Brown, Ms. Esther Tobias. Coach, Ms. Tashika Claxton. The following changes occurred at the commencement of the academic year. Mrs. Golda Palmer resigned and was replaced on grade six by Mrs. Stuart Rollins. Ms. Kiana Weeks, who was accepted at the teacher's division of the Clarence Fitzroy Bryan College was replaced by Ms. Jacqueline Liber. Fundraising activities. We were able to conduct the following. Mufti Day, Days, Valentine's Fest, Walkerton, Spelling Bee, Talent Show, Fun Days. Everybody breathed a great sigh of relief when sports day was held on Friday the 25th of March. In fact, we were the first, despite the hindrances of COVID-19, were able to have a successful event. At its conclusion, Blue Dolphins emerged the champion with 673 points. We had the Blue Dolphins. <laughs> you could come better than that. Yes. Green Parrots second with 543 points. And Red Bulls, 502 points. <laughs> the victor of Durham being Kimali Benjamin. Kimali cannot and take a dog. A greenhouse. Sit down. And the victor being a tie between Ricola Thomas of Green, a grade 4 pupil, and Adassa Delaney of Blue, a grade 5 pupil. Parents Teachers Association. The executive, ably led by President Mr. Chad Kelly, continued its deep involvement in the activities of the school. They spearheaded a number of activities for the school's 60th anniversary. Also, they generate funds from a breakfast, which have been used for toilet renovations. Staff development. Teachers were involved in various development workshops organized by the Ministry of Education. Internally, training was done in e MacBook and using the MS Team platform. Grade 4 and 6 teachers were deeply engaged in the Enhanced Curriculum, or CAL, Key Stage Assessment of Learning, conducted by the Curriculum Developed Unit. Projections. As we transcend into the new school year, we probably highlight some areas we want to look at changing of the physical education uniform, two, facelift of the physical plan, three, installation of internet in all classrooms.